ดีค่ะ Welcome to Learn to Speak Thai Channel where I will help you to learn Thai and speak like a Thai. Welcome to the new series. In this series, we are going to talk about Thai question words. But the most important thing is I need to show you how Thai question words work in Thai language. In English, when you want to ask someone name, you will say what is your name. But in Thai, it's the other way around. It's an opposite because this is how we say it. We say your name is what. So in order to create a questions in Thai, you have to speak backward, and that's the trick for you. This is how you will create a Thai question. You simply add the question word at the end of the statement. For example, you like to eat what? She comes to Thailand when? See, it's really easy to create a sentence in Thai. Let's start with the first question word in Thai language. Chai mai, chai mai, chai mai. It's really formal. It's mostly used in written Thai. If you don't want to sound too formal, use this. Chai mai, chai mai. Now you see that the word mai become high tone. Especially this day, you might hear the teenagers say this question word as "ใช่ไหมใช่ไหม This is acceptable. You can use in everyday questions, but do not use when you are in a formal situation or in Thai written language. ใช่ไหม is used when you are sure about the information. You just need the listener to confirm that your information is correct. It's equivalent to "Aren't you?" Isn't it? Is that right? Is that so? You use all these question tag when you are sure about the information, but not 100% sure, and you need them to confirm if you are correct. Let's go to see the example. เขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมเขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมเขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมเขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมเขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมเขาเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมเขาเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมเขาเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหม On this example, you will hear the word. Ben, this is verb to be in Thai language. If you missed this episode of Ben, click right here and come back to learn more about this episode. On these sentences, the question word at the end are slightly different, so it depends on the degree of formality of your question. Don't forget, ใช่ไหม is used in an informal situation or written Thai. ใช่ไหม is used with spoken Thai, and ใช่ไหม It's really slang of asking this question. To answer Chai Mai questions, if your answer is yes, you use the polite particle, k r a p for male speaker, ka for female speaker, or use Chai as the answer. If your answer is no, you simply put Mai in front of Chai. So Mai Chai, Mai Chai. If the answer is no. เขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมครับเขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมครับเขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมใช่เขาเป็นคนไทยใช่ไหมใช่เขาเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมไม่ใช่เขาเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมไม่ใช่ I'm sure a lot of you have heard of the word ฝรั่ง For some of you who haven't heard of this word, ฝรั่ง is a nickname that Thai people use to call foreigners. So if you are a foreigner, you will be called ฝรั่งเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมเป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมฝ
From the question, you see that this question word a missing pronoun. It's acceptable in Thai language to not add the pronoun in your question or your statement. If the pronoun is well understood, you can simply drop the pronoun. เป็นฝรั่งใช่ไหมไม่ใช่เป็นลูกครึ่งไม่ใช่เป็นลูกครึ่ง Now this answer not only say no but the person also give the correct information so he said no I am ลูกครึ่ง Look clung. Look clung means mixed race. If a foreigner married to a Thai, their children will be called look clung. In this question, my chai pen look clung. This is the pattern. You say no, which is my chai. Follow with pen and follow with the correct information. Now it's your turn to answer my question. คุณอยู่เมืองไทยใช่ไหมคุณอยู่เมืองไทยใช่ไหมเมืองไทย means Thailand To answer the question you click right here it will bring you to my website and you can leave the answer at the comments area Don't forget to come back because we still have a little bit to show you at the end that's it for this episode. On the next episode, we will talk about the other question word in Thai language. If you don't want to miss a lesson, please subscribe and click like to this video. I'll see you next time. Sawadee This is the last episode of Work to Be Awesome. <laughs> it's all work to me. <laughs>